Finally, tonight we head off the beaten paths that normally sports lead us down to a sport that actually is one of the oldest in Whippeal history, yet one that you'd be hard pressed to find anyone knows it even exists. Walking down the third floor hallway at Mount Lebanon High School, you'll come to a door that looks like any other, but inside you'll find something quite unusual. Yes, that is gunfire in a school, but no cause for alarm here. This has been going on in Mount Lebanon for more than 80 years. It was the first sport they had here at Mount Lebanon. And what year was that? 1933. Mount Lebo is actually one of 16 Whippeal schools that has rifle as an official sport, though there's a pretty good shot you didn't know that. There's a lot of people, even people that went to this school for four years, didn't know that this was down here. When I wear my sweatshirt out in public and stuff, I do get questions sometimes like, oh, you're on the rifle team, like, what's that like? But it's also an unusual sport for another reason. Rifle is the only Whippeal sport where the guys compete right alongside the girls, and typically, it's a one-sided battle. The best shooters are always the girls because they listen, because they don't know a thing about it and they pay attention. They don't have any bad habits and they just let it go. So it's one of the few sports where the girls beat the boys? All the time. Oh, of course. Why is that? The girls are better. Don't you know that? <laughs> I don't know. Girls are usually more focused than guys. And it turns out focus is the most important thing in this sport. This is unlike any sport you've ever seen. It's not an adrenaline sport. It's a mind and body control sport. If you get excited, you will not do well. So if you're thinking about homework or boys or dinner yeah. tonight, what's going to happen? Uh, it's probably not going to go where you want it to go. You can watch the kids get excited. Insert one round in the chamber. You get them in a big match. Let me lock your bolts. They'll start hyperventilating. It's interesting. Shooters have 10 targets at a distance of 50 feet. Most at this level will hit bullseye on all 10, which means it comes down to just how perfect your bullseyes are. And there's more equipment than just a gun. In fact, if you like, I'll put you in a jacket and a sling. Sure. And you'll see what it's like. All right. What had I gotten Enjoy. myself into? This will be your first opportunity at Olympic rifle shooting. The first thing we have to do is put on the jacket. All right. Onto the jacket goes the harness, which connects to the rifle. Under the rifle goes the glove. Onto the floor goes the shooter. OK, now your cheek goes on there. And you want to look right through the sights. This novice was pretty good in two warm-up shots. And when you're on the target, go ahead and squeeze the trigger. But each successive shot went further and further off target. And then the, body, the body fatigue starts winding yeah. them down. Okay. Clearly, this should be left to the experts. I enjoy it. It's fun. I like being focused on one tiny little thing and being able to make this minute perfection that's so hard to accomplish. I'll probably keep it as a hobby for the rest of my life. It's my favorite sport to do. I've played a lot of different sports. This one's stuck. All right, now this is proof. Here is my target. Mm -hmm. I did not do well. I would have been cut <laughs> from the team before the season even began. A lot of kids try out for these, a lot of cuts, uh, but still a very interesting sport. And let me tell you, by the end of that, I took six shots. I was sweating. I got home that night. I had burn marks on my shoulders. There's no kickback from the gun. It's simply from the jacket and the position oh. you have to be in. It constricts you so tightly. It's not as easy as it looks. Well, it I mean, looks like you had your eyes closed. <laughs> I think I, I would have done better if my eyes were closed. And those are real, what I real bullets that they're using? 22 caliber, yeah. And it's interesting. Gun and school in a sentence usually sends yeah. off sirens yeah. of panic. Here, it's been going on uh, for more than 80 years. They say more than 4 million rounds have been fired just at Mount Lebanon wow. at that rifle range. Hasn't been one injury in over 80 years. The amount of concentration with that has to be overwhelming, too. Just, It's incredible. Yeah. All right. Jory, thanks. Jory, sure. thank you so much. Have to work on your shot. All right, let's turn things Typical over to... girl <laughs> telling detail. Because right? <laughs> you're better at this, right? Yeah. I've never tried. Yeah. I'll try. We'll, we'll do a competition one day, okay, Jory? Done. All right.